Are you looking for an awesome little cruiser to get out of the house and social distance with your family and friends and still enjoy the summer? Then come with me for a quick walk around tour on this 2003 Sea Ray 26 Sundancer. She's extremely well equipped. We've got fender baskets, an LLI feature to lay out on the deck, full enclosure, and extremely well maintained. So stay with me because from here we're going to do a complete walk around tour. Here we are starting off starboard bow. We see we have an oversized anchor to make docking and anchoring a Catalina that much easier. Sea Ray does an excellent job. We have all stainless steel hardware. Notice the forward facing horn, wire fender baskets right here. And then coming down along the side, this four deck again is what I call an LLI. Just have a nice pad made and the ladies spend the day out there. Coming down along the side, we see we've got that curved Taylor windshield with a nice tint on that. Our Sea Ray badge right there. Now, the boat has a four and a half bimini with a full enclosure, but being the middle of the summer, we have it all down. This is going to give us a quick interior view. There's our nameplate right there. We've got our waste and water. This owner has gone above and beyond. He's added a fresh water flush there to protect the engine. Here at the transom, we have the extended swim platform with a three-step boarding. Once aboard the swim platform, we see we have trunk storage here, grab rail. Our electrical connection goes right through there, and we have a ski tow eye. A big plus is the fusion stereo control right out here. This is going to give us an overview of the cockpit. We enter through the starboard side and immediately in front of us we have a nice wet bar. To port we have a fold away transom bench seat and a back-to-back -back chaise lounge. This is another LLI ladies like it feature they can sit facing either direction now over here at the helm we've got our captain's thigh rise captain's bucket seat with the thigh rise bolster right there at the helm she's loaded with electronics the leather wrapped steering wheel our outdrive angle indicator down below, we've got our VHF radio, separate GPS. And right here, we have our Fusion Stereo, Ray Marine system, dual screen, Ray Marine chart plotter radar right there. Behind that, we have our classic Sea Ray gauges, compass, and here's a view from the helm right here. Circling around, we see we have an overview. Engine access is through this hatch. And one of the nice features is you don't even have to lift up the table. We've got a nice three 5.0 engine. Neat, clean, the bilge is nice and clean. We have dual batteries from 717 right there. From here, let's go inside. We enter the cabin through this sliding door. Notice Sea Ray's incorporated the steps, so it's easy access to the bow. We enter the cabin, down a few steps. Immediately to port, we have our power panel with our Fusion Bluetooth stereo there, AC DC panel. Circling forward, we have a galley. 
nice pro butane stove storage above microwave formed in fiberglass easy to care for easy to clean down below we have both storage and our refrigerator as we circle forward we see we have an oversized V berth it's a over seven feet gunnel storage We've got a nice mirrored anchor locker and then right over here we have our thermostat this vessel has shoreside air conditioning We've got a nice hanging locker right here now this table can be lowered and it becomes a nice sleeping area filled in There's also storage underneath. Moving aft, we see we have a fully lined fiberglass head with the vacu flush system and a mass raider discharge. We have an RV style shower right there. Easy to care for, easy to clean. Now as we circle around, here in the steps, got our little waste basket and our mid cabin back here has some nice features first of all we have a window for light and air there's our life jacket this is about 56 inches wide here for two people to sleep comfortably you do have some headroom there also with its own air conditioning vent and a more storage compartment. This berth here is about seven and a half feet long. Do Less is a fine example of a well cared for boat. She's neat, clean, odor free, right size, at 28 feet LOA, viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts.